Well, how often do you partner with people when it comes to the real estate? Well, we partner now with other people's projects as passive investors. We earn enough and saved enough that we can do that. Uh, and then if there is someone who is doing a rehab and they have a good idea and they can present the idea to us, we will be lenders to them at a fair interest rate for their rehab money. Uh, and there are attorneys in, in our group, yeah. in our network, who can help put an agreement together so it's safe for both us as the lender, if you will, for the rehab money and also that individual who is doing the project. So it can be anywhere from a, a small project. A multi-million a dollar project. deals. And, and that's the thing. You don't have to do it alone. There is always people that will come along with you financially, boots on the ground, regardless if the deal is small or bigger. But you do need to have what? The network that you can make a call and say, hey, would you like to partner with me? And having someone with that power team, with that background, it does give us the ability to be successful and to grow, to get to our own destination much faster. So that's what I love about our network. So now that you have all the experience, why do you still partner with people? Because they need someone like me and my wife to help guide them so that they don't make the same mistakes that we made along the way, but they can also we share with them our successes as well, why we were successful in a project or what the pitfalls were. We like to bring people along because as you build a team and you're successful with that individual or that team, you build a family of sorts. It's a network that can continue to go on for years. We still have investors from 14 years ago, our very first house that we did before we actually got into the yeah. real estate business, who are still with us to this day. We travel together. We've been to each other's kids' weddings. It's, it became part of the family. It became part of the family. And I think that's what it is. Real estate is not just a transaction that happened at the title office. This is people that we work, that we brainstorm, we bring deals back, back and forth.